Welcome to another Ziva Math video. In this video, we will be learning how to find the area of a square. Area is the measure of two-dimensional space inside of a flat shape, and it's measured in square units, such as square inches or square meters. So one thing to remember with area is area is measured in square units. So if you have a shape with grid lines underneath that you could just count how many square units are inside this shape as you can with this square, you can go ahead and do that to find area. So if we are counting the square units, we have one, two, three, and four. So we have four units squared inside this square. So that is one option you have besides just using the formulas to solve for the area. However, most of the time you're going to want to use the formula to find the area of a square. The formula for finding the area of a square is area equals s squared, where s is the length of the sides. Remember, side squared will be the same calculation as side times side. Let's go back to our example and solve it using the formula. So the formula to find the area of a square is area equals s squared, where s is the length of a side. And in this problem, our sides of our square are two units. So we're going to have area equals, our side length was two, we're going to substitute two for s, so area equals two squared. And then remember, if we're squaring a number, in this instance, we're going to have area equals two times two because we had two squared. So the area of our square is two times two, and two times two is four. And because we're doing area, it's four units squared, just like we got when we counted up the square units inside of our square. In this example, we have a square with side length of four, and we're gonna use our formula area equals s squared to find the area of our square. And our side is length four, so we're gonna take the four and substitute it for s, so we'll have area equals four squared. And four squared is four times four. Four times four is 16. And we have area, so it's centimeters squared. So the area of our square is 16 square centimeters. In this example, we have a square with side length of five. And one thing to remember about squares is they're also rectangles. So if you're more comfortable using the formula for the area of a rectangle, you can use that formula with a square. Remember, you just need a length and a width. Well, because this is a square, the length and width are both equal to five. Then you go to the formula for the area of a rectangle and you substitute those values. So we'll have area equals, well our length is 5, so we'll substitute 5 for L, times W, our width is also 5, so we'll substitute 5 for W, and we get area equals 5 times 5. Well that's area equals side times side, so it's the same basic formula. So we have area equals 5 times 5. 5 times 5 is 25, and we're working in feet, so it's 25 feet squared. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to Ziva Math for more videos.